it is 6.09 p.m. I am here with an energy drink, which I've not been paid to show you. Um, a knife and a fork, which I have also not been paid to show you. And this is going to be eating attempt number two. Mind you, I've got my teeth in, and they are fixed with the adhesive. Is anybody picking up on the... Uh, Mrs. Doubtfire reference yet? No? Okay. So, what I have here is I have toasted a pita, which was a bad move in the first place, toasting it. Um, but inside of the pita, I have mixed together, before I put it inside, some honey and peanut butter. And I have sliced up a very ripe, soft banana. And that's what's inside of here. Now, the regular version of this um, would also have some cinnamon granola in there. Not trying to go there right now. Not gonna do it. I've got my very first piece here that's eeny beeny tiny. And see, I'm looking at it like it's a fucking monster, this piece. And I know better than to try and eat something this size right now. And let me explain. My gums, they still itch, they still hurt. And now I know for a fact that I have two dry sockets that are untreated. I won't be getting them treated until Friday. That's the earliest they could see me. Um, right now, I'm on 800 milligrams of ibuprofen for that, and that's it. Um, I'm not using a topical pain dump, dumber, duller to pain reducer. Anesthetic. My God. So, no Ambisol, no Aura Gel, no nothing like that. I've got a little bit of a, a little bit of adhesive that's been holding my dentures in for the last couple of hours, actually. So it's not like I just put it on. And because my gums itch so much right now, my instinct is to take my tongue and push them up out of my mouth, or to push them up off of my gums, so that I can get a little bit of relief. And I'll tell you right now, this one is moving a little bit. You probably couldn't see that, but it had come up. See? It's got some... Some movement right now. But, uh, I know better than to attempt a bite of bread this big. Like, and I'll put the picture up here. I posted it on Facebook earlier. I tried to take the Montax out of my son's donut earlier, which is me taking a bite out of his donut and then giving it to him. And I managed an eeny bitty little bite. And I was on absolutely no meds. Um, we had just come from the dentist office where I was there getting a bottle of uh, socket gel so that I could treat my gums and, you know, do things the right way. I was in so much pain. I wanted to cry with every single chew I took on that eeny bitty piece of donut. But damn it, I got my mom text and I ate it. And the boy just looked at me like I was crazy. He sat back there eating his donut. Like, why did you even bother? So, whatever. This is about four times as big as the bite of mom text that I got out of that donut earlier. And that is some chewy ass peanut bread. And I toasted the pita because I figured that would take some of the chewy out of it. Because I always get the really good pitas that are like super chewy and super soft and super nice. So far, I've been able to squish the honey peanut butter and the banana out of it. Well, I'm not making, I'm not making a lot of headway on chewing it. And this has just come up. All right, there went down a little piece of it. Ah, and look, this is completely loose now. Like, I can take that all the way out. Ooh. Oh, that feels so good. The air on my gums right now. And I don't dare, I would love to just sit here and, like, gum the next piece of it up. But I've got dry sockets, which are open. Um, and I still have open wounds on the on my gums, so... I really shouldn't do any of that. So, 
Let me put this back in. Isn't it amazing how different the speech is with it out and with it in? It's just crazy to me. Okay, here's the next piece. And I cut him into little, little beanie slivers about as fat as my finger. You can't tell that though because the, the banana is starting to squid out of this one. Let's see if I can take a bite off of it. Uh oh. Nanner overboard. This hurts so much. I'm going to keep wanting to chew on just this side. Because when I had my teeth before they all got pulled, this side had a molar that had like half of it missing. So it was like a big scoop out missing and it would hurt every time I got anything into it. So I favored chewing on this side. It's good pita, but god dang it hurts. Alright, I was able to swallow it. Ah. Okay, so I won't say that I'm having any easier of a time eating today, but chewing loosens up this denture still. So that's something I can't wait for is to have my implants done and have my bottom denture secured, my final denture, my permanent secured into place. So I don't have to fuck with that anymore. That seems to be the biggest problem that I have. So I started off with adhesive and I ended with none. Like I could totally, and I need to. There's like a peanut butter under there and it stings. <laughs> I don't feel good, y'all. And my husband's in... Is he in the bathroom? Yeah, he's in the bathroom, so I have to wait before I can brush my teeth. That's how far I got. Y'all, how fucking sad is that right now? I'm sure Philip leaves the rest of it, though. Let me see if I can get the rest of this peanut butter off of here, because I'm looking at the talk talk like this with the whole rest of the video. Oh my gosh. It's not even like a lot of peanut butter, either. It's like some peanut butter flavored spit that got up underneath. Nana stings though. I'm sure there's two but orange all out here. I'm not very smart though, am I? Hey, do you want the rest of this? I can't. I even cut bits of it into any beanie little strips too, and I can't. I can't eat it. I keep. It pulls this loose, and then I get peanut butter up underneath of it into those open wounds, and into the two dry sockets that are there. Oh yeah, fuck that. It hurts, huh? I told you sticky. I don't need. I told you so. I need. I'm sorry. That's better. Thank you for liking, commenting, especially commenting. I love to read and respond to your comments. Um, and subscribing. Uh, don't forget to turn notifications on so you don't miss any of the uh, Denture Adventure journey. Uh, and yeah, that's it for today. Thanks again, everybody. And until next time, keep being awesome.